How's it going, guys? So, when we last left off, we had just killed the boss of the first section. Can't really call them floors, because it's not like top and down kind of thing. It's more of a, I don't know, left to right. It does go down eventually, too, but we're not there yet. Oh, man, this guy's so creepy. Something important has drawn you down into hollowness course. But I won't ask what. Perhaps the reason you found me is because you need my help. Say no more, friend. I'm just gonna give you a gift. A nasty little spell of my own creation. It's just perfect for a little one like you. <laughs> I hope you like my voices. They're the ones I hear in my head. Yep. I don't know why why we would ever trust a guy that looks so evil. And also, it's just, I love stuff like this. It's just so simple. Just tap A and it works. That's it. Should we talk to him or should we just keep going? I think we should try and escape him before he doesn't have it. Shit, yeah, boy. I love this one so much. It makes it so easy to kill those really tough enemies. There's actual roly bullies now, by the way. I hate them. They're annoying as hell. I think my favorite thing about this game, though, definitely has to be the fact that everything is a bug. I mean, even you are to an extent. You're like a sentient bug. But, ah, they're so gross looking. Oh my god. Okay, there we go. Got him. It's like shooting a gun at someone with a sword. Reminds me of that Indiana Jones thing. Just shooting him while he's trying to blaze in his thing. You know, actually, they were originally going to have a big old sword fight, but then, um, fuck, what's his name? Uh, shit, oh my god. What's his name? Oh no. Oh, this is bad. I can't remember his name. Whatever. Whoever played Han Solo, I know I'm gonna get crucified for that, but I don't remember his name for some reason. You'll need to put it in the comments below or else I'm gonna look like an idiot. Or I'll end up remem remembering it like halfway through. Harrison Ford! Oh my god! I'm an idiot. Yeah, so Harrison Ford had some really bad, a really bad, like, stomach flu or something, if I remember right. And so they decided to just, instead of shooting the big ol' uh, sword fight scene, they just had him shoot him. Because he just wasn't feeling good and he wasn't having any of it. He's like, I'm not doing this no matter what you say. So they're like, fine, then shoot him. And I think that's one of the greatest things ever. Come on, get back here. Alright. Now we're on our way to this guy. Ah! Oh my god, no. Shoot me another one of your babies, you fiend. I really should've- no, oh, come on! Lame- oh. Yeah, that guy's kinda easy. What are you, Soul Catcher? Hmm. To put the charm up the charm's money while resting on a bench for well, that, I can do. I was watching over you while you slept. I must have slipped away myself. I woke up and found you disappeared. Oh, you are a surprising one. Oh, oh. Actually, I wanted to ask a small favor of you, you see. There is a certain creature lurking just above us in the heart of this temple. Oh? Well, yet another surprise. You've slain the creature before I have even asked. I scarcely deserve such a friend as you. You're a marvel. <laughs> you better let me out. 
God. The gate has opened. Yeah, no shit. You're the one that probably owns this place. Fucking weirdo. Alright. Now, we can equip a soul catcher. Yeah, so there's these notch things. So you can't just equip every single item. You have three notches, and some things cost two, and others just cost one. So you kind of have to use, you know, a strategy, I guess, on how you're going to use it. I guess I could have just jumped down here. That would have been smarter. Okay. Um, bit of an idiot. Well, let's continue. I think I'm going to try and go back up top so I can get... Oh, he left me. Asshole. I think we're going to try and go back up top so that I can get the map stuff. Because I think I should have enough for both of them. If I'm not mistaken. We'll see. But it'll, it'll make it a lot easier to explore down the line. Because right now it's not too difficult since I kind of know my way very well around here. But eventually it'll become too difficult to actually do without getting lost every other turn I make. I wasn't paying attention. Ah. Alright. So. Let's see, I think the compass, I think, was 220 and the quill was 150. So I should have more than enough. I might even be able to get another thing. So sad. Her husband is always in the caves. He's all, all alone up here with the weird old guy. Who I guarantee you is going to end up being some bad guy. Oh, and I can get one more. Okay. Um... I think the Stagway might be the better bet, actually. Yeah, let's... Uh, hot Springs... Cocoon... Bench... Ooh, actually, Bench. That'll be good for when we need to... save before we go. I'm just gonna go sit down real quick so that we can update on that. And now... Oh, well, it shows us up here right now, but... Now we can just go down the Stagway instead of having to... Start all the way from the beginning. There's, it's just very simple things like that that just makes this game so nice to play. Like, it's so pretty and it's just very simple mechanics that make things easier, but to the point where it's not too easy. Just enough to keep it interesting. But yeah, so now that we're down here, you see everything is highlighted. We can see the two different, uh, the two different seat areas that I've found so far. And then I think now that we're out here oh I go down one more. I could get the compass, right? Do I need to equip it? Oh I needed to equip it. Shoot. <laughs> Let's go back up to the stack so I can equip it. Otherwise I'm gonna get lost trying to figure out where I am. It's gonna make it a lot easier. Yeah 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 whatever kill myself. There we go. Now, there we go. Now I can see myself. I think my favorite thing too is that you can see him in the background looking at the map and he starts walking slower, but nothing, time never stops or anything. So it's like you still need to be paying attention even during that time. Oh, got a big old fatty right here. Oh. He's, oh shit. I forgot about those. Died. Okay. I'm not sure. Oh, you know what else I do need? Well, we'll see. There's a, another shopkeep that's down here that we need to free. So we'll do that right now. And then, see where your life takes us. No. Who knows, maybe next we'll end up in some sort of weird sewer thing, or... I don't know, what else is weird and funny? End up in a circus! There we go! 
Yeah, so... Everything is so dreary here. It's so nice. Oh, man. Here we go. Boss fight number two. Oh shit, already into a bad start. Good to know. No! Oh crap. Stop! Come on, just let me hit you. Stop being such a booty face! Come on, I hate... He's just so annoying. He's not even, like, that hard. No! How'd I miss? Oh my... There we go. Okay, now I can't heal, though. And I'm at one hit. This is bad. What the heck? No! That's BS! Ooh. I'm just bad. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry you had to see that and experience that. Don't worry. We'll we'll get him back. It should be easy enough. Hopefully, I'll actually be good this time. It's not worth it. Actually, probably was worth it, but it's not worth it. We're just gonna get our stuff back really quick and try and kill the fly thing. It's really annoying. Oh, what? I forgot he could attack. Damn it. I thought he just floated towards you. I hate you. Oh my god. Yeah, see how easy that was? Come on. Not even difficult. Now this part's annoying. And... <laughs> I'm awesome. I'm great at this game, guys. There we go. Easy. Easy money. Here's the crazy man. Oh, oh, you're off. You reeled your nail like a club. Ask me, how much deeper do we have to go? Oh, oh, what? Who are you? I see. This old village, what a strange dream to have led me down here. If you hadn't found me, I don't think I would have ever woken. I'm sly. Usually I live an eventful, uneventful life up in Dirtmouth. The air in, the, in these rooms doesn't agree with me, so I'd best be getting back. If you return above, come and see me. I'm probably the friendliest face left there, and I can thank you properly for your good deed. Well, <clears throat> I don't like that voice. We'll change it next time. That hurts. But yeah, so now there's another shop open up top, and he sells insanely expensive things. Like, insanely expensive. I'm pretty sure they're supposed to progress the story, but still, they're like, stupid expensive. Anyways, I think that's where we're going to leave it off, and next time we'll probably try and do get to floor 2 or something. Maybe experience other things, like floor 2. Oh god, I always forget about that. I, that would have been so annoying if that's how that episode ended, wouldn't it? Oh well. Alright. Next time, we'll try and go to floor 2, and I'm gonna try not to die right here. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. And there we go. Alright. Well, that's all for now, guys. See you next